there have been a number of enhancements to unfolding. First of all, I'm just going to unfold my entire character uh, by setting the edges and then doing unfold and pack. We can see that there are two buttons now. The very first time you only have one option because it needs to do the entire unfold and then pack. But once that's done, you can now update without actually packing. So if I uh, select my character, and we can uh, now have a look. The first thing you notice is that well, here we can look at the, the face. In fact, I'll do an island selection. Just move it off down here. And frame it up. As we can see that it is nicely symmetrical. So if I want to make some changes, here are some improvements. So let's say uh, we have a look around the back of the head here. I want to make an update to my unfolding seam. Well, I'm going to add to the cut line and with island selection, make sure I have nothing selected here except for what I want, which is the head area. In island selection, we can see it update here. I can now go into the tools and do re-unfold selected islands. And then now it won't do the entire object, rather it'll just update the selected island. Uh, as you can see, everything else is in place and it's still doing symmetrical. Now it's updated the seam there. If I had moved more pieces, I could have also do uh, update with no packing and it won't change the positioning of all of my elements.